Zane Gonzalez. I'm a kicker from Deer Park, Texas. It's just a little town. You see, everybody, it's like one of those things where everybody that's like grew up there stays their whole life. And they love me out there, I'm not gonna lie. I go back home, they have like in the high school, they have like a little shrine. I remember telling myself when I like, uh, like sophomore year, I was like, I'm, no matter what happens, I wanna leave. Or in a little second of the road, like you need to get out and see it. Like that's why I love traveling. Like I just wanna like get out of here and experience something new. And ASU offering me like just, made that dream come true. I grew up playing soccer my whole life. My dad played soccer. So literally from the age of like three till I graduated, just all the time I was soccer for like three or four practices a week, practicing like an hour away. So I had to make that drive every day. But my dad, I can't say enough about him. He would drive me every time. Me and my brother, my sister, whatever we wanted to do. But me and my brother always played for the same club. So I would practice like six, he would practice like eight. So you'd be at the soccer field until like 10. It was a fun time. I had a lot of memory. I think it really helped me out a lot. And then eventually came junior high, kind of wanted to do like be the super six where you play all six sports. Played football as a receiver and then kind of the way I did uh, kicking was like whoever kicks it the furthest gets to be a kicker. My brother was like a kicker in high school so I was like alright sweet I need to win this. Ended up winning it actually and then uh, kicked it, didn't kick any field goals in junior high. Eighth grade just played kicker and then high school got better and better and then by junior year I was pretty ranked pretty high. Won a lot of showcase stuff like that and then from there the whole process of recruiting for kicker is not very fun. A lot of rough nights, didn't like sleep this night trying to get recruited. Just honestly really lucky and blessed I got, it, got the opportunity to come here and got an offer. And my dad was ecstatic, my brother was happy, my sister and my whole high school was happy and then I got a chance to leave which I always wanted as well. But when that time actually came I got dropped off, I was pretty sad but I mean like I said no regrets, I love, I love the issue and it's made me who I am today. I remember my first game was pretty rough, I was like two for four, and then throughout the season just got better and better. And ASU made me the man I am today, Coach Graham, the whole coaching staff. Couldn't choose a better place to go to school, better weather, better environment at that. I mean, ASU is a beautiful place. Probably live here when I'm older eventually. I love it out here, and I feel like the best school in the country. This could be pretty historic, guys. It's from 46 yards out. And he got it. I actually wasn't even thinking about it, but then after I hit it, it wasn't a clean hit. And I remember slow motion, it was a perfect snap, perfect hold. I was like, just don't screw it up kind of deal. And I didn't hit it right, so I was kind of nervous until the last second, then I saw it went in, and then Matt was celebrating before I was, and then it was just, it was an awesome feeling, being able to do that at home in front of the home crowd. ASU helped me achieve my goals because just in almost every way, like aspect of life, I mean, being a student athlete and having Gene, Coach Graham, preach, character, getting through life, I think that's what you're gonna need to have. You're gonna need to be disciplined, be able to have time management skills, and being able to, no matter through it, like what's going on in your life, the rough patches, just knowing that you can get through it. Coming here and being able to experience something new, it really changed me, and I think it's the best thing that ever happened to me in my life. Next level is a goal. I mean, nothing's guaranteed. I mean, you see it all the time, just, like, you, you can't predict the future, so you can't ever be humble the whole time. Some of nation, the whole community has really helped me achieve my goals. Just keep me positive and optimistic and never let me get too low. It's always kept me up, kept me going. I knew I always had their support and, and I can't think of enough for that. Being a part of the Sunday Brotherhood is amazing. Being able to serve the community, help out in the community, lead every, I mean, everything you think of. Being a Sun Devil is probably the most important thing that's happened to me to this point. And I mean, honestly, that means the world to me. It's an awesome feeling to be able to say I'm a part of something.